Hi everyone and welcome back to the Sims 4 Not So Berry Challenge Rose Generation and I'm recording this straight off from the last part because the moment I basically stopped recording Poppy um, came out of the bathroom, she was having a bath, she grabbed some spaghetti and then she went into labour so I knew she was going to go into labour soon but I didn't think it would be that blooming quick so here we are. So she's about to have a baby. This is exciting. Uh, Gen 3 is on its way. I feel like we we barely started Gen 2, but here we go. Um, so she's only allowed one baby for her generation, so this will be it. And um, we also need to decide where the frick we're going to put this baby. So I already told you we are going to be naming the baby Amber. I think this really suits the yellow theme for the generation. Um, hope you guys like it. I know Poppy has a girlfriend called Amber at the moment, but they're not going to be sticking around long, so don't you worry about that. Oh, Lily's just come home from her, wherever she went. I think she went on a date, didn't she? Um, she's just like, oh, there's a baby in the house. Eh, whatever. But we do need to, um, we do need to decide where we're going to put the kid. So she had a good time on her date, and she's, she, if she wasn't so exhausted, she would be feeling flirty, so... And her relationship's gone up a little bit with Calvin. So that's because of that mod I've got. Um, I don't think I did link it in the last video. So I'm going to go back and do that now. Uh, but yes, Amber's here. Oh my God. We're going to have to also tell Romaine about this. <laughs> so let's try and get a, a little screenshot with Poppy and her baby, her shock baby. And it's dressed in a yellow uh, all-in-one, which I know is what the babies wear. But how lovely that our yellow gen baby has a yellow crib and a yellow um overall all in one onesie type baby baby grow that's the word i want um so we're gonna get grant to come and check out his granddaughter poppy's probably feeling a bit overwhelmed she's got this crying baby she's just like oh god i don't know what to do i'm just gonna eat my spaghetti but grant's gonna come over and um tend to his grandchild i think grant and cherry are gonna be very very active in this um raising of this child oh bless him <laughs> poppy's just sat here just like i don't know what to do you deal with it dad <laughs> you're gonna have to learn girl so we need to sort out what we're gonna do in terms of where we're gonna put the baby i think what i'll do is i'll swap poppy and lily's rooms over and put the baby in with poppy's room so i'll do that as a little speed edit for you now Okay guys, so I have done it. I hope you like it. I mean, I did do it very, very quickly. I just swapped the rooms around and um, eventually, I guess when um, Amber is a toddler, we're going to have to have another rethink. But for the moment, while she is a baby, she's okay in her mum's room. But I mean, Poppy's na room, well, her room now is, is quite big. So I kind of think we could maybe split it into two small rooms oh, i don't know this house is getting a bit small i don't want to move because it's like this is the family home but i'm I, I did try putting a second story on the house and it just didn't quite work i'll probably have another go off screen but i'm not a builder so if any of you guys are particularly good at building what i'll do is i'll save this house to the gallery after this um part and um 
you have to click custom content because obviously there will be custom content in this build but you can put a second story on if you want and then just tag me in it hashtag phg simmer and that would really help me out but um if not i'll have a go on my own <laughs> but it won't look good that's all i'm saying so poppy um is actually taking care of the baby which is good i actually quite like her room it's a bit busy maybe i'll change the bedding but for now it's fine oh amber's so cute and it kind of makes sense to me that the older one has the biggest room. I mean, my brother, we have a three, three, my parents' house is a three bedroom house. And my brother actually has the biggest room because my mum wanted the front, a room at the front of the house. My brother's got the room at the back and it's enormous. Whereas I have the teeny tiny weeny box room that I can just about, like basically I have my bed in there, my cupboard, um, not cupboard, like a, a bookshelf and a little three drawer thingy, uh, like a chest thing. And that is it. I have no room <laughs> and I have like a little path to walk around the bed. And that's pretty much it. Okay, so everybody's waking up. Grant's the first one awake. He's awake so early these days, but I guess that kind of makes sense because all people tend to wake up early, don't they? <laughs> but we'll send him back to bed for a little bit. Okay. That will have to do. So uh, Poppy's fun levels are really low. What can we get her to do? She needs to do her homework. So she's going to do that, even though she's going to hate me for it. And then she can, she can do something fun. I guess we could get Grant to maybe help her. Because um, that always... That always makes the homework go faster. Okay. I don't know why they keep doing it at this desk. Like, I don't know why the computer doesn't... Why they keep doing it on the keyboard? They keep eating there as well, which is really annoying. Okay, so they got to go to school in an hour. She's not going to go to school in a very fun mood, but never mind. Lily's just waking up. So I want Grant to help her with her homework. Uh, la, 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 la. I can't find it. Let's lecture about her responsibilities. Like, you're a mother now. I mean, Poppy's quite sensible in terms of she's doing well at school, but she is a bit rebellious in terms of um, her love life. Since she became a teenager, she just sort of gave up with school a little bit, but she's naturally quite gifted, I think. Oh, bless her. How's Lily doing? Lily did her homework, so she can just sort her needs out before school. Use the bathroom. I hope she's got time to take a shower. She might not, but we'll see. But yeah, this house is getting very small. I have actually made Poppy her own like little apartment for when she's a young adult, but now she's got Amber, I think, because maybe until Cherry and Grant die. I don't know what to do, actually, because Amber has to have a really good relationship with Cherry and Grant, which will be easier if they all live in the same house, but then I want Poppy to be independent, and I don't know. Maybe she'll go and live in the city for a little while and then be like, I can't cope and move back home. Um, who knows? Let's see. All right, Cherry needs some food. But yeah, I'm definitely going to have Grant retire when he gets to the top of his career. And I think Cherry's going to age up in a couple of days into an elder, which is kind of sad. And we're going to have her um, retire as well because she's at the top of her career. I mean, Grant and Cherry have been very successful sims. It's awesome. Okay, Lily's off to school. Poppy, you need to finish your homework before you go to school. Oh, the baby's crying. Uh, we have to get uh, Granddad to come and come and sort that out i think oh should we get cherry to do it let's get cherry to do it because she needs to have a good relationship with amber too but poppy oh my god you are not done with your homework yet come on you're gonna be late she's nearly there come on come on come on there we go there we go come on i thought you were there yes right come on go 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 get to school girl I think her having to balance having a baby and school and her love life and her social life is going to be a little difficult for her. But Cherry's been a good grandma. Oh, bless her. What's she doing now? Why is she freaking out? Okay, Grant, we're going to send you off to work. He's done everything he needs to do, so hopefully he gets that promotion today. Or at least he'll get it in the next few days that he goes to work. And we're going to get some breakfast before he goes. And Cherry, she needs some fun, man. Let's get her to play a game.
we get Grant after his breakfast to come and tend the garden. Before he goes off to work, though, I doubt he'll have time, but we'll see. So what I'm probably going to do is whiz through until they return home from work. But look at all these goodies we've got in the garden. We're going to make some gash today. We need to evolve some of these things. Harvest it all. I love the fact that our garden's got a little variety. I know, like, not everything makes the most amount of money. And when I'm doing, like, challenges where I need cash, I tend to just plant up loads of dragon fruits and loads of blackberries. But um, that was never the point. Like, Cherry's always been into gardening, so it's nice that she's got a variety. Okay, so we're going to send her to work on her own. And Grant's going to do a little bit in the garden. I think he has to go to work at 10. Is it 10 p.m.? Not 10, 10 p.m. Uh, 10 a.m., I think. No, no, don't miss work. Why is that? Oh. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> you should be using your phone in class. Confiscate it. Right, yeah, go to work. Uh oh, baby's crying again. Ooh, she's a bit of a crier. We'll have to get Granddad to come and sort that out. Come on, Grant, hurry up. Okay, so Poppy and Lily are both home from school and they're feeling super tense, which is not great. I'm thinking of getting the family, like, um, an animal, like maybe a cat or a dog, because you can really reduce Sims' stress and increase their fun levels with, with having a dog or a cat. So I think that might be quite fun. I mean, our house is a little bit busy at the moment, but there we go. Maybe we'll have a think about that. So um, Poppy's going to come and play a game and Lily invited Devin over. She's doing that funny walk again. I love that when the teens do that. It makes me laugh so much. It <laughs> just like so can't be bothered with life. But we're going to... Um, we're going to... Uh, Probably have a little chat with Devin. She's a cute Sim. <laughs> Look at Lily walking. Oh, bless her. She's just like, ah, oh, life. I can't be bothered with it. <laughs> Come and have some uh, spaghetti. You'll feel a lot better. And then take a nice soak in the bubble bath because that will definitely de-stress you. Okay, right. Oh, God. I, th I love the fact that Poppy is playing on a video game and Devin, who doesn't even know this kid, is coming to look after the baby. <laughs> but Grant's home from work now. He's probably going to walk in and be like, uh, Poppy, what are you doing? Your kid is crying its eyes out and you're playing a video game. Um, maybe you want to parent that little one a bit better? <laughs> I think they're giving her the benefit of the doubt. This is the first few days of being a parent. She doesn't have a clue what she's doing. She's not prepared. Um, so they're giving her the benefit of the doubt. It's probably just like, I'm stressed, I need to play my video games. I don't, I'm, I'm not bothered about the baby at the moment. <laughs> and Grant's like, yeah, well, you know, that's not how it works. Um, even when you don't feel like it, you need to take care of this child. They are going to, um, oh, what's the word? Molly, Molly, Molly cuddle her a little bit at first. I think they're going to be a little bit, they're going to let, let Poppy get away with a lot, I think. Okay, Grant, what's the problem? Okay, so the baby's feeling a lot happier now, so we're going to get um, Grant to come and do his um, report. He still didn't get promoted, but I think that's probably because he was late to work today, which knocked his performance back a little bit. But why don't we come, have Poppy come and chat to Devin. So we're going to brighten a day. And what else should we do? Let's just start being friendly, ask about a day, be like, hey. Devin is pretty cool, actually. I really like her as a sim. I didn't create her. I just grabbed a load of teens off the gallery. Brighten up this room a little bit. Just seems, I don't know, they had a patch and they said something about the lighting and it seems like everywhere's a little bit darker now. I don't know what that's about, but um, I just add some more lights in here to brighten up the room a little bit. I don't think we should boast about messing around. I don't, I think we've probably already got a bit of a reputation and um, I 
Candida, can't you? It wouldn't be good to uh, to uh, spread those rumours ourselves. <laughs> I kind of like miss in The Sims 3 where you would um, get a bad reputation. I'm because I'm playing The Sims 3 University at the moment. Um, one of my Sims, it's like the, the gossip mills are turning. But Lily is having a nice soak in the bath, and then we're going to try this um, mod thing that I got again. And she's going to go and socialise with Calvin off screen. I guess we should call it. Okay, probably let's try and be a parent. She's feeling embarrassed because obviously she says something to Devin that she shouldn't have done. Oh, Devin! No, Amber is not hungry. Well, she might be hungry, but she's got green stink lines coming off her. That generally means that she's got a dirty diaper. So you're going to have to get out of the way. So we have to just, like, say something to her. Come on, Devin. Let's, um... Ask about a career. I just want her to move, basically. There we go. There we go. We're going to go and change Emma's dirty diaper. And then I think she's going to go and talk to her dad and get some reassurance from her dad. There we go. Let's uh, give her some love. We're going to feed her. See, she's doing well. I'm proud of Poppy. She's she's just a, a young girl herself. She doesn't she doesn't know what she's doing, but she's doing her best. That's the main thing. She just needs to learn that uh, her baby comes first now, not her. Like, you know, video games come after you've looked after the kid. <laughs> Grant's just like, I'm going to go outside and try and de-stress. Ooh, nice bonsai action there, my friend. <laughs> Cherry's home from work. She's feeling stressed too. We totally need to get a dog. <laughs> I think a dog would be... Good, because if they're feeling stressed, they can take the dog out for a walk. Um, cats are kind of more like independent and aloof, but Cherry's going to come and uh, use the bathroom. And, yeah, play a video game. But I want Poppy to come and uh, get some reassurance from her dad. Be like, am I doing okay? I feel like I'm the worst mum in the world. He's like, you're not the worst mum in the world. You're doing good. Okay, Devin is leaving. She's probably like, this is too much drama for me. I'm off. <laughs> I just wanted to hang out with my friends and now I seem to be a babysitter. <laughs> oh, she's about to get another parenting skill. Awesome. All right, Cherry, come and uh, get those fun levels up a little bit. But I want to... Where is it? Where is it? Oh, we have to do it on the computer. I want to get a doggy. Um, we're going to adopt a dog. Yes, awesome. Oh, yay! She got level two of the parenting skill. I'm so proud of her. Good job, Pops. So she's going to go and uh, chat to her dad and be like, I feel like I'm getting this. I'm getting better. Grant's going to be like, you are going to be brilliant. Just give yourself a chance. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to adopt a puppy and she's going to get some food while she's waiting because we're going to have to have that inspector person come over. Hopefully what happens, <laughs> if my cats and dogs LP, they came over and it kind of glitched out and we ended up having like 12 little um, baskets everywhere. Okay, so oh my gosh, which one do we get? I kind of, hmm, I was thinking initially no to a puppy, but now I'm just like, oh, they're so cute and I don't really like some of these older dogs. I don't really want a German Shepherd or anything like that. Oh, do we get a puppy? They're so cute. Oh, Maddie's cute. Oh, Maddie. I kind of want her. Oh, Annie's cute. Meryl. <laughs> I don't want like a Shih Tzu. Ah. Uh, oh God, no. Am I picking two here? I don't want two dogs. No, I've got three. <laughs> We're going to get Maddie, I think. Maddie is a little terrier. We're going to go for Maddie. I think because we don't want a huge dog. I love the way Cherry's just like, hasn't even consulted the family. She's like, I'm getting a dog, by the way. You had your baby. I'm getting a dog. <laughs> Cherry's always been really family orientated. I think she's probably like, I, I would love to have another kid myself, but I'm getting a bit too old now. She's going to be... Um, an elder soon so she's like i'll get a dog instead <laughs> i put all my affections into this dog but yeah we're gonna give this little popper a friendly intro and we better schmooze up the uh inspector we'll give her a cheerful intro 
Oh, she slammed that fridge door. She is stressed, but you'll be okay. I think this dog is going to do wonders for this family's stress levels. We're going to have to get some um, pet supplies, though. Where are we going to fit dog baskets in this house? Oh, God. This is a bit of an impulse purchase, I guess. Oh, we're going to give Maddie a little pet. I like the name. I think I'm going to keep the name Maddie. I like it. Let's uh, offer friendship and praise. Talk to. Oh, I love the way Grant and, um, and Poppy are just sat having a conversation on the sofa. It's really nice. Anger management. Oh, that is so appropriate. Um, I think we should definitely talk it through. Yeah, talk it through. That is so appropriate for this 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 family at this moment that she needs some anger management. Bless her. Okay, so we need to impress this lady. Oh, wow, she just like totally jumped there. That was weird. You need to eat your spaghetti though because you're getting hungry. But look how much her fun levels have already gone up. That's so cool. So let's uh, chat up this lady. Poppy's playing video games, but it's okay to do it now, Poppy, because the baby's asleep. So <laughs> it's all good, but you do need to do your homework. So we are going to have to say no to the video games. You don't need it. You're having fun. Look at Grant showing off. He's just like, look how great I am at cooking for every my knives around. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't do that when you've got kids and puppies in the house. Not good. Okay, so we're going to adopt Maddie. I love the way Lily walked in and went, oh, there's a puppy here. Okay, mum's gone nuts. <laughs> mum's just gone out on a limb here and bought a puppy. So, no, we don't want you to lay the table. What are you doing? Cherry Rich Comedy Level 4. <laughs> Stop laying the table, Lily. <laughs> oh, God, she's feeling very playful. She's looking a little bit insane. Come and do your homework. Just calm. Oh, she's done it. <laughs> calm down a little bit. But you can come and socialise, maybe. Or, uh, yeah, come and socialise. Come and chat with Calvin, of course. That's who she's got her eyes on for her boyfriend. They did have their first kiss, so we should definitely ask him to be our boyfriend at some point. We'll probably have Lily Garden date, but obviously Poppy is the focus of this LP because she is the second generation heir. So we will have Lily Lily going on in the background, but um, she's not the main focus. Grant has prepared some chili. Lovely. I think he's just showing off to the adoption lady. But we're adopting this puppa whether you like it or not, lady. Yeah, it ended up in my Cats and Dogs LP with like 12 of these characters. Well, I think it was more than 12. It was loads of them. Which was not good. They just kept spawning. And I was like, oh God, am I going to with like 3,000 pets in my house? But luckily that did not happen. Okay. I think we'll probably take Maddie into Create a Pet. Just have a quick look at her when we've um, adopted her. Come on, Cherry. Okay, Lily, why are you obsessed with laying the table at the moment? She's never been that obsessed before. I guess it's because she's got her manners or responsibility have gone up. But we don't... I love the fact, though, that the adoption ladies come around and we're like, yeah, we lay the table every time we eat. We always sit as a family and eat. None of us sit and eat at the bloody sofa or on our beds <laughs> trying to act like the perfect family but uh yeah we're gonna we're gonna keep the name as maddie but add the surname rose because she is part of our fam oh she's so cute congratulations you've adopted a dog so we're gonna end the evaluation now you can leave our house now we've got the papa <laughs> you can leave <laughs> Good. i think she's leaving Oh, Maddie's cute though. Totally cute. I'm not quite convinced I want that tail. I think I'm going to put the longer tail on her. Once we're in, create a pet. <laughs> oh, you Oh, she is so adorable. Oh, I love her. The only thing I want to change is the tail because I don't like these curly tails. Let's give her, we could either give her this one or the up one. I think we'll just give her the normal tail. 
But I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a big thumbs up. We've got the baby. We've got the papa. <laughs> if you, you did, uh, do leave a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next part. Bye, guys.